All right, guys. This is the eruption volcano kit we're gonna be building today. We got Hi. Annabelle. Wave, Annabelle. Hi. Yeah, and we got her brother Colton. Colton Hi. is. Uh, I'm making... the owner of the channel. He's just, yeah. He he's uh, the guy who runs the channel, so he tells me what to do. And we're gonna be building this kit. So today we have citric acid. It's really bright in the sun. Uh, we have baking soda. And then we have a sand mix to actually build a volcano. So we're going to go through and build it. And then we're going to show you what happens with a chemical reaction when you actually combine some of these things to make a volcanic eruption. All right, I also guys. I have two other sisters. Yeah. And this is my teddy. I have him since I was a baby. That's the teddy. All right, Teddy's probably going to show up in some of the videos. He's the mascot, right? So, yep. all right, guys. Let's go ahead and get started. Yeah. We've got the instructions here, and we'll be right back. With. When we get it going. Yep. Alright guys, so we are just about to put the sand and dough mix uh, around the outside. Yes. Now, what we got to do is we got to cover everything except for this rim. So we got to cover this whole part and then leave a crater in the middle. And you just build a little wall up around the top of your volcano that's going to be really important later so that the chemicals have a spot to mix and react and make your eruption. So Colton, Go ahead and start grabbing that dough out and start putting it all around the volcano in a nice thin layer. You got it, Dad. Better hurry up. Looks like it's getting hard. Pack it in there. Pack it up. All right, so we'll do it like this, see? Just pack a thin layer all the way around the volcano. It's getting thick. And it's kind of like a dough consistency. So don't put it in chunks. You got to break it up and then spread it out. All right. I have to break it. So look, listen, listen. Hey. You gotta use it like uh, you gotta kind of smush it out around the edges, and then put it on there. It's heating up. This dough is uh, pretty fast acting. Oh, this is so also, guys. Huh. This is gonna take a while. We're we're gonna have to do another kind of video soon. Right. Yes. Yep, yes. so we're going to edit back out to when this is all on. Hopefully it's not Guys, like all fine. completely dried out by then, but it's almost there. So we'll get right back to you when we get this all done. Plus we're going to have to wash our hands. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. All right, see you in a second. All right, guys, we're back. We ended up doing things a little differently because that... Yeah, it, it didn't work as we planned, but yeah, it just hardened in too fast. So powder, we have Play-Doh. So we use Play-Doh. The powder that we got in this kit went really quick. So we ended up using Play some Play-Doh and I actually stuck some underneath the mold so that it would hold up the tube in a little bit better position in the crater. But you got to leave a crater because that's where a lot of our chemical reaction is going to take place on this kit. All right, so what we have to do now is we and have guys, to... And guys, remember, you can do this with powder if you're really quick, or Play-Doh if you're not so quick. Okay, so be sure to leave a crater at the top of your volcano, which will be used later during the eruption. Um, so we applied that, and now we're going to go to erupting our volcano. So we're going to get the volcano eruption ready, and we are going to show you what happens when a volcano erupts in your house. I don't know what's gonna happen. So you have to pour uh, you pour oh, let's redo this. Sorry. So you mix water with your citric acid to make your lava. And you add three drops of red and three drops of yellow, as you can see right here. And if you want a thicker explosion, which means it'll be bigger. You add a couple drops of soap, but if you don't want to be big, you add these, these to make it more colorful, and not this. All right, so we're going to go ahead and get our lava ready. Um, what you want to do to make your lava is create a chemical reaction. So in order to do that, you have to mix certain chemicals. Colton showed you the citric acid, and the citric acid is going to mix with baking soda. And the baking soda is going to create a chemical reaction um, between the two, citric and baking soda. So we're going to do that. We're going to leave baking soda. We're going to pour it into the top cone of our mountain, our volcano. And once we do that, it'll be ready for us to pump in the actual citric acid, which is why this thing has a cone 
that comes with it on the top. And, so. and guys, if you like this video, destroy that like button down below and let's get some likes. If we can get 50 likes on this video, we do another really cool video. Probably even... <laughs> probably even on the TV me playing Minecraft. All so right. smash it down below. All right. Like and subscribe. There you go. We'll be right back. All right, guys. This is it. The moment of truth. What we've all been waiting for. We have our citric acid mixed with a little bit of dish soap, like two drops. And then we have uh, also some food coloring in there to make it a little more colorful. You can see them here. And we are going to insert the tube of citric acid firmly into the tube that goes into the volcano. It leads up into the volcano, into the top. You can see we have baking powder, baking soda, which is actually sodium hydrocarbonate. And we are going to pump the citric acid up in to our volcano. It's going! We have a reaction. Oh, we gotta keep it in there. It's spilling everywhere. And I think if I just pump some in like that, we might get an even better Whoa. eruption. Awesome! It looks just like a volcano, right guys? We got lava. It is pouring out of the volcano. Just like a real one. It's spewing throw up. Yeah. And if we try to pump a little bit more. Oh, we have an eruption. Yeah, it's a big one. <laughs> yeah. Here it comes! It goes, whoa! It just slapped like a fan. <laughs> to be honest, I thought it was going to go like up to that chandelier up there. <laughs> no, we didn't use carbonated water or um, some other things that can make it really explode. We're going to do that on a later volcano video, guys. This has been our volcano. You can see it erupting over the sides. All of the foaming oh action is the reaction between the citric acid and the baking soda or sodium carbonate. All right, guys, this has been a building video with Colton and Annabelle. You guys say hi. Hi. And say goodbye. Bye. Thanks for watching, guys. Hit that like button down below and subscribe, and we'll try to make some more great videos. Maybe the next volcano will get even bigger.